hello everyone and welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome you might as well stay and subscribe and be a part of the fam fam but today's video as you guys can tell by the title is going to be how i grow my hair out so i will insert pictures of where i started and where i am now um i started my hair journey back in 2014 and I did the big big chop and chopped all my hair off had a shortcut and ever since then I've been growing my hair out so I'm going to be giving you guys some tips on how to grow your hair tip number one is protective styling find some way where your hair is not being manipulated you're not putting too much heat on it um, my protective styling is I do a lot of you part wigs um, just just because my hair is not being pulled out or my edges are not being pulled out um, so I do you part wigs which is basically kind of like having a sew-in you can sew it on you can use combs to um, hold it on I prefer sewing it on and then you know I take it off every month or every six weeks and I'll shampoo my hair you know give my hair some love um you could do braids crochet braids um twist outs wash and goals whatever you prefer um so yeah protective styling and tip number two is finding products that work for you meaning what shampoos and conditioner your your hair likes does your hair love moisture protein whatever so for me um my hair is a moisture meter so i do the um tresemme uh shampoo and conditioner and this is the luxurious moisture one and i get these from walmart and i get the big bottles so i'll go through two of these before i go through one of these which is the um shampoo so find products that work for you um deep conditioners uh do your hair like light deep conditioners heavy deep conditioners i personally when i deep condition my hair i use this as a base for my deep conditioner and then i throw in some oils i throw in some like a deep conditioner pack that you can get from the hair store <clears throat> i do those so five products that work for you and number three when you're heat styling heat protected heat protected i cannot stress this enough you straighten your hair every day don't do that because you're gonna get heat damage then your hair is gonna break off and you're not gonna be able to grow your hair out and grow long hair like you want to heat protected anytime you're heat styling you're blow drying your hair use heat protectant you're straightening your hair use heat protectant you're curling your hair use heat protectant and don't use high heats when you're straightening or you're heat styling your hair i personally don't go over 400 i'm either at 380 or 400 most of the time 95 percent of the time i'm at 380 i do not use over 400 degrees on my hair and i do not do more than two passes when i'm straightening my hair so please be careful with the heat okay we don't want breakage any of that <clears throat> so tip number four clip your ends okay clip your ends you're not going to be able to grow your hair out you're doing all of this you're loving your hair you're giving your hair moisture if your ends are straggly and thin clip them i clip my ends probably hmm, i clip my ends thoroughly when my hair is straightened so whenever i straighten my hair i go in and really clip my ends i get any fairy knots out of my hair and these split ends i see that are about to start or are starting to split i clip them off immediately because once it splits up the shaft you're done you're done so you definitely want to clip your ends either often or whenever you you know straighten your hair or every six months every three months every two months clip your ends because if your ends aren't 
nice and clipped and all the dead hair is off your hair is not gonna grow so it's pointless for you to do everything else if your ends aren't clipped so yeah tip number five is moisture and protein okay moisturize your hair moisturize it if it's oils if it's a um you're deep conditioning your hair you're finding um moisture products do it moisture and protein you always want to do a protein treatment if it's every other deep condition whatever it is you want to do you want to create some type of protein in your regimen because you want to build strong hair if you're doing a bunch of moisture you're over moisturizing your hair your hair is going to be kind of easier to snap so you want to you know put some protein in there so when i deep condition my hair i'll throw a protein pack in there you could do the afro g um two-step protein treatment that's really good i use the palmer's coconut um protein pack i use that and that's my protein treatment that's you know i do light protein i don't do too heavy of a protein you don't want to do too heavy of a protein you have to figure out what your hair likes and then go from there so moisture and protein is a big key and number six this is the key the major key to how I've gotten my hair so long with doing everything else um you need to do everything else and to get in order for number six to work okay so number six do I'm gonna tell you guys my secret hmm I think I think I think I can spare it so number six is a hair supplement okay um, I use the Nature's Bounty Hair, Skin, and Nail Gummies. They look like this. This is my hair supplement. Okay, I take these. These have biotin in there. So basically anything that any hair supplement should have biotin in there. Or you could just take biotin itself. But biotin is the key. Okay, is the key. It's going to give you the maximum growth okay you can get these from walmart rite aid cvs any drugstore carries these dollar general carries these okay and they are um about seven to ten bucks depending on where you buy them from go to walmart not cheaper so um i take these and on um the back it says it recommends uh two um, a day or whatever for the serving size um, I started out with two and then I upped it to three once I figured out if you know my body was okay with it because you can break out from taking biotin if you're not drinking a lot of water and you're just taking them you're gonna get some breakouts because it is for your um, your skin as well your nails are gonna grow um, I used to be a nail biter and these are my natural nails now so a uh, hair supplement is key okay hair supplement is the key so that's pretty much how i have grown my hair out to be the length it is today is by taking care of my hair i don't let a lot of people in my hair and i find products that work for my hair i'm not heat selling my hair all the time i'm not pulling and tugging i don't do a lot of ponytails in my hair so that's how i grow my hair out and that's pretty much it so if you get some help from this video definitely comment below if you have any questions um i if you want to know any other products i use if you want to see any other videos in the future pertaining to hair definitely comment below might as well subscribe <laughs> as well and rate the video and yeah that's it so i will see you guys in my next video bye